Now, parents are going to want to hear this. A Metro mother is sending out a warning tonight about a social media site. It's a new one you might not have heard of. She says her daughter was sexually assaulted by a 29 year old man she met online. They used a site. It's called Omegle.com. New here at 6 News 9's Heather Hope is live in the newsroom with this one. Heather. Amanda, the 14 year old girl says she started chatting with the 29 year old man on Omegle.com in May, thinking she was talking to someone in high school. But she says he kept lying to her and by July he had already been to her home several times while her parents were gone. It's just a, a way that strangers meet strangers. That's how this Norman mom describes the website Omegle.com. She says her 14 year old daughter had sex with a 29 year old man she met online at least five times in their home. Parents don't have no clue what's going on because the kids are hiding it so well because you don't have to register on this Omegle site for anything. The 14 year old girl says she didn't know the man messaging her was 29 years old. And at first he told me he was 16 and I was like, oh, okay, cool. What school do you go to? And he was like, oh, sorry, I'm 18. And then um, I was like, oh. Once her parents found out and she fessed up to the whole thing, they told Norman police and the man she called Bo, whose real name is Boulian Hoangvale from Laos, was charged with rape on October 9th, but he hasn't been arrested. I'm scared that he's doing it to other girls that aren't knowledge about what kind of guys are out there. Alicia closely monitors her daughter online now, and she says she just wants the man who took advantage of her daughter behind bars. I don't feel comfortable with some 29 year old man having intercourse with a 14 year old girl anywhere. You know, that's just not right. He needs to be off the streets. An arrest warrant has been issued for the man. Norman police say he lives in Oklahoma City, and detectives are making arrangements to have him picked up. Live in the newsroom, Heather Hope, News 9. Heather, thank you.